Hello, today we're gonna build a house in The Sims 4, but the challenge is that each room is a different Pinterest post. So let's go, shall we? Oh, we freaking shall. Now, there are many different ways you can play this challenge, but the way I'm gonna play this challenge today is that I'm gonna search up a room on Pinterest. For example, Oh my gosh, no, I name a room. Name a woman. A shed. Let's say I'm gonna build a shed. And then the first image we get on Pinterest, I have to make. No exceptions. Nah, nah. That's how we're gonna do it. So without further ado, let's start. And now I do believe we have to start with the exterior of the house. Because that's important to have a house first before you decorate it. That's what I always say. Build before you decorate. Let's do exterior first. Let's go. Uh oh. Okay, at first glance, I was like, this is going to be easy. This is a nice, easy house to do. But then I saw the front garden. Is that is. What am I even looking at right now? Is it AI? There's something weird about this picture. But that freaking pond. I mean, it's wiggly boogala. I don't even know what's going on over there. Wait, how many pipes does this house have? Five? Six? Is that a pipe? What are they cooking in there? The pond is giving the pond from Coraline. Oh my gosh, I'm getting haunted by Coraline everywhere I go. Oh, so let's just start it with the house, huh? It does look look like it's maybe two tiles and then three and then four tiles for the window and then two tiles i mean that seems reasonable enough and then we have a little house oh my gosh what is going on back there what is happening i don't know what i'm looking at right now i mean just look like it's on a little hill because of the stairs. Okay, so I'm, I have to do some terraining. Nora, terrain. I am terraining away. That was probably too much. Now in the picture, it looks like these two houses are connected to each other. But I don't think you can do that in The Sims. Because if we try to connect them, yeah, that's gonna happen. And we don't want that to happen. But um, I'm gonna... I'm gonna take some creative liberties with that. What is going on here? A little pipe there, maybe? And then there's like this little roof that goes into the windows? What? To be honest with you, I have no idea what I'm looking at. I simply don't know. But anyways, I'm gonna deal with that later. Because <laughs> I don't want to right now. I'm gonna do the roofing on this house instead. Then a little spiky roof up in here. More spike! Oh, I see. In the back here, the roof is connected to that house. How am I gonna make that work? Right, what if I take another gable roof? Like so? Yes. And... And what do I do then? I take a hip roof. I mean, that could work if I just do it properly. Oh, shoot me good. I'm gonna make that work later. Don't you worry. I, I just need to think about it first. All right. So now we have to figure out the window situation, which is something that I'm so excited about. I love windows. All right. I have looked through every single window that I have. I don't have all the packs, unfortunately. Because I have a student loan to pay off. That I indeed have. So <laughs> I don't have any windows that look exactly like this. But I think I'm gonna go with these from cats and dogs good now let me place them and it's sort of similar to the picture <laughs> not really but kind of some of the windows i of course cannot see but i use my imagination and just put them in don't look at the roof don't look at it don't look at it anyways it's looking fabulous <laughs> now all i got to do is put some pipes in what pipe could work this one maybe there's so many pipes on this house yeah okay 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 there's a lot of pipes that that it is it's a lot of pipes but um that's what's on the picture and I think they're looking lovely. Oh, and don't worry about the hard contrast between this brick and that brick. I'm gonna hide everything up with the vines that's on the house. Don't you worry. I'm gonna hide it up like I normally do. Right, I think I am gonna start working on that freaking pond. So I have no idea what's going on there. So what if I just get my little terrain tool and put it in with some water? And then, all right, that's gonna be so difficult. What if I instead use the little fountain tool and try to make some sort of shape myself? Can I make an octagon? What if... Oh, Jesus, no, this is no, no, Nora. I don't think I ever want to do that again. Don't, don't look at, don't look at the fountain. <laughs> Let me just work on this little fountain. Let me cook. Let me cook. It's starting. It's starting to look like the little fountain that's on the picture. I mean, it's a little bit angle-y. And on the picture is round. But we're gonna hide that up with some rocks, some bushes, and some flowers. Don't you worry, don't you worry. I'm gonna hide it up. But if we have a little look at a picture again, there is a little hedge around the pond. So I think the only reasonable thing I gotta do is to place the hedges one one by one and make the circle myself. Oh, and I'm also just gonna put in some rocks around it because it does look like the pond has a lot of rocks around it. Yeah, it does. So I guess I'm gonna be doing that too. Putting them rocks in everywhere I go, just putting them in there. In the little spot, I'm gonna put them in. Oh, oh Jesus, gang. Why do I do this to myself? I don't know. But I'm gonna put them in their little spot and I'm gonna work, work this out. I mean, the hedge is still looking terrible. It's wonky, but okay, it is wonky on the picture too but not that wonky it's not that wonky but i have used so much time on this literally i have to place every single one by hand rotating them like a wheel in the wind 
this pond is going places that I'm not invited to. But anyway, so I'm gonna take a little break from that pond. I don't really want to look at it anymore. And I'm just gonna start putting up some vines on the house. That seems lovely. Maybe I'll make a little time lapse of this. Who knows? Are you enjoying the time lapse? Are you? Is it everything that you wanted it to be? My lovely little time lapse. Just for you. I now do realize that the fountain needs to be closer to the house. I do now realize that. But if you believe for one second that I'm gonna move anything on this lot, you are absolutely insane. That is not gonna happen. And I also had this little thought. You see it right here? It kind of looks like it's a little balcony right there. So I think maybe I have to make a little balcony. Maybe. If I just push the house a little bit back, then I just make a tiny little balcony. I mean, yeah, that could work. Oh no, I destroyed everything. What is happening now? Oh, but no. But what I also discovered when I looked at this picture was on the side of this house, it looks like there's a little wall here. So maybe that's like some sort of balcony thing. So what if I get a little platform and then we get a little half wall just to secure it in and then we can have some vines and some little bushes and whatnot. Yeah, that could work. And oh Jesus, you may be asking, no, there was a round roof on the picture, not a rectangular one like this. Well, for that, I have to say that I tried literally everything to make that work. But since we have this god forsaken balcony up here, every time I put a roof on this, it just goes through the balcony. And I even tried with this little round roof, but it just looked ridiculous. So it's gonna be that. Oh, what happened to my little pipe? Hello? Are you okay over there? Oh, oh well, how could I forget? I also fixed my roof. I somehow managed to fix this roof. I don't know how I did it, but I did. And I don't want to talk about it. All right, so if you have a little look at this picture, you can see that there's like a stone arch with a little stone wall or it's a big stone wall. So how am I going to recreate that? So that can work. And then <laughs> we can have a little stone wall up in there. And then a big old fence that goes there. <laughs> My game crashed. I am too disappointed to even have a reaction. I... Oh my gosh, did I save? Okay, it's still here. I managed to save, actually. Oof, that doesn't happen often. So here, <laughs> here's the little entrance. I put up some little bushes. Wow, wow, wow. It kind of looks like the picture, a little bit. And now we shan't put up the little hedge maze. Now I know the hedge maze is rounded. Got some curly whirlies. But the only way we can do that in The Sims is with the rounded rooms. But with the rounded rooms, if I remove the flooring, it removes the rounded curve. And if I remove the the flooring now it does have the curve but if i remove one of the fences over here it deletes the curve and i'm not dealing with that today so it just gotta be a little angle fest up in here oh flado look at them look at them go over there i put in my hedges i put in some flowers and i put in a little walkway it doesn't have any curves but it still has the spirit just like me and now my game froze wonderful how do i get out of this i don't even want to i'm gonna go to the bathroom i hope you're fixed when i come back okay i hope you're freaking fixed well right Righty right. I had to start my game all over again. It did not want to work. But anyways, I do believe I'm done with the exterior of the house. I do believe so. Oh my gosh. This is a massive house. <laughs> this is a massive house. Right. But hey ho, why don't we go to Pinterest and we are gonna search for entryway. Ooh. There's a lot of plants in there. There is. Is this also AI? I don't believe in anything anymore. Let's put in some wallpaper to add kind of matches. And then a little carpet. Okay, what carpet matches? Maybe this that does have that sort of vibe in it yeah yeah and the lights that's on the wall the wall lights they call them I mean, we can go for these and then they do have a little table over there that's very skinny i don't think we can get that skinny of a table but um we shall try i can maybe go for this one it does also look like there's a mirror meta there you go and on the other side they have like a really fancy picture so what can we get for them there i mean you can get this guy there you go hope you're happy with that <laughs> all right now i just have to put in a bunch of flowers some menti plants Plants in here. Gonna be fun, fun, fun. Alrighty, tighty toe. I have put in all the flowers and some plant gear. I mean, if you're gonna have this many plants, you, you need to take care of them, alright? And of course, when you take a picture of a room, it's hard to show all four walls of the room, you know? So, I mean, I, I took some creative liberties and I put in some shoes and just some little nickety knacks on the wall. Alright, that's allowed. If I can't see the wall, I can do what I want, but within reason. Otherwise, it's just gonna be a blank wall. Let's move on to the next room. And since this picture is doesn't include a stairway and we do need a stairway because there is two floors i need to search up for another hallway so one two three let's go hallway Ooh. 
I like that. I'm just gonna put in some stairs first. What can we put in? What about this? Yeah, that can work. And then for the wallpaper. I mean, we do have this wallpaper, but I don't think we have it in green. No, we don't. Do we have any other wallpaper that matches? Nope. We just gotta go with this one. I'm sorry, guys, but it's close enough. It's close enough for me. And then the flooring. I mean, that's, that's easy. And then there's this little table in the corner with a marble top and wooden legs. Do we have something like that? This is the closest we have to that. Like show. And then we need a little light. Oh, it's not little. That's a mahusi. That's expensive. Do we have something like that? We do have that light. We also have this light. I think that one's the closest. I do believe. Gonna go for that one. Oh, shoot me good. I forgot the railings for the stairs. Do we have something that matches? Kinda. That one's the closest. Yeah, gonna go for that one. <laughs> and on the walls, there's two little picture frames. So maybe we can get something like that. Can we? Yeah. Those are so cute. Nice. I am done with this room. And now we shall move on to the kitchen. To the kitchen. So let's go. Pinterest kitchen. Oh. Yeah, that looks like a lovely little kitchen. We can only see one corner of it. But you know, looks great. <laughs> right. So first of all, let's find the counters. I mean, I think this one matches the color best. I do believe. And right here. What do we have right here? That looks like a stove to me. And over here, there is a little sink. I think we just gotta go for this one. Doesn't really match the color, but that's okay for Nora. And then we can't see the rest of the kitchen. So I just have to improvise. That's all I do. And then we need some cabinets. And they have glass cabinets. We also do have glass cabinets, but these are end pieces. So maybe I just have to make that work. Yeah. Let's put in some wallpaper. This one matches well enough. And then on the other side, it has some sort of green paint. So maybe something like that. Oh, like that. That's not that terrible. And then we need a little stove hood. If we have any green stove hoods. No, not the kind that I want. I think I just gotta improvise here. What about this? Can I just size it up? I mean, maybe. It obviously doesn't look like what we have in the picture. But in the end, nothing matches what's on the picture. <laughs> Another table off the table. All right, I have looked through every single table and none of the tables matches. I mean, this table would have been really good, but it doesn't have a matching swatch. What is this? So I know, I know that this table doesn't look like the table in the picture, but it, it matches in, in spirit. <laughs> right. And then for the chair. Wait, hold on. They only have one chair on that side? Jesus galore. Okay. Oh, I'm not gonna lie. This kitchen is looking pretty weird. And it has to do with the size. This is too big of a kitchen. Oh, yikes. You know what? I am just gonna close off this room and nobody ask any questions. Don't ask it. Oh, before I forget, we need a trash can. There we go. All right. I have decorated the kitchen. Wowie. I have given them so many plants. And I'm giving them some little pots. Maybe they have been washing them. Who knows? And on the picture, they had this thing on the counter that I had no idea what it was. It kind of looked like a little, like a little vase, but it also kind of looked like one of these. So I just gave them both, really. Hope you're happy with that. And on the other side, I just did whatever, really. And in the corner here, I'm not done. And the reason for that is they're gonna have a dining room as well. This is a mahusive house. I need to fill it up with stuff, and they do need a dining room. So I don't know where I'm gonna put the door. And I've come to the conclusion that I'm gonna give myself the creative ability to go around and change furniture and stuff for the parts of the rooms that we cannot see, all right? Because otherwise, I am gonna cry. I am. But before we do the dining room, I thought that we could skedaddle over here and do the living room. So, Pinterest, give me my living room. Boop. Oh. Oh, that is very dark blue. Good IT. First of all, I'm gonna put in the wallpaper. That looks fine by me. Let's go fireplace. Oh, well, I'm, I'm gonna go with that then. And then we need a window. Pop that in there. Do we have a blue bookshelf? Oh, we can go with that. If we just push it into the wall a little bit. There. I can work for Nora. It can. <laughs> okay, let's, let's have a little look at the couches. Oh, yikes. All right. I have looked through every single couch that I have. And I've come to the conclusion that this is the best couch for us. Now, it doesn't match the color. It doesn't, but none of the couches matches the color. So there it is. And then they have a carpet that they indeed have. They have a carpet. I mean, we have this one. It, um, yeah, sure. Why not? It's, it's with the spirit. And then on the fireplace, they have a lot of these sort of lights. What do they call again? Candles. That's the word for it. Oh, and they also have a mirror. A mirror? Do we have a good mirror? Oh, yikes. No. Can I take a picture frame and just push it into the wall? I mean, that's looking very fast. <laughs> I like that. Okay, so the window. They do have a little window sill. And I don't know how to do that in The Sims. Maybe. But just maybe. If I just take this one, turn it around. And then I size it up a little bit. Not that much. Yeah, and then we can just have some nicky knacks on there. 
where did I go? Now on the picture, they have these little like details on the walls that kind of looks like pillars. Can we have something like that? I mean, none of the pillars really match. It doesn't bring anything to the function. Okay, that one matches the color, but eh, there is something to that. That can, that can probably work. All right, I have finished decorating the room. Oh la la, some nicky nacks over here. This is actually so cute. I love this. And then the little bookshelf, fireplace. Here is the little windowsill. And then this wall is just completely blank because I don't know where the door is going to be, you know. But all right, let's move on to the next room. Pinterest, give me my bathroom. Oh, what is going on with the sink? Is the sink going over the bathtub? I have no idea, but let's try that. Let's try it. I think I'm going to use the same tiles that I used in the kitchen because it kind of looks like it. Yeah. And the flooring. I mean, the flooring is kind of like bobbity bobbity checkered all around. So maybe I'll do the same. It's going to look ugly, but uh, here we are. And then the bathtub. I mean, I think this is the closest. And then the sink. Oh boy. It has like a draw thingy thingy and it has some shelves and the long plank and a sink that's a oh, but jeebus me what if we take a shelf this one and we size it up and then we just copy that over here well that doesn't work <laughs> wait okay i fixed the sink i used another shelf i used the one from snowy escapes that seems to work and then we have a shelf under there and then i put a little nightstand under there and it's starting to look like the picture yeah and then they indeed do have a little carpet can we find one i don't think we have a square wicker carpet uh, you know what that one that one will do just fine and then around the back bathtub they have this little shelf so can i recreate that somehow what about this one then i size it down like show that might work let's put some stuff on that i mean we don't have a little tiny wicker basket like that but what we do have is this one hamper i'm gonna size it down and put it on there i mean there you go nobody would suspect the thing hope you're very happy with that and on the side they have these little square shelves i don't think we have that but what i can do is take these ones size them down and then scooch them into the wall i can do that yeah, that looks fine. And then we can't really see the rest of the picture. So I'm just gonna put in some naked knacks. There we go. Put in some naked knacks. And I'll put this in the corner with a plant on it. Picture. Some more towels. And there's the window. Okie dokie, it's night time for the dining room. So let's search for that. Oh, that's looking fine. I mean, I do think, I do believe we gotta use the same table as I did in here. Yes, that's the one that matches the best. And, and then for the chairs. Oh, okay. They do have some mixing and matching of chairs. So we can go for that one. One, and this one and then for those other chairs what can we do for that okay i've decided to go for these chairs they don't really match and you can't use them for the table but that's the best that we got okay that's the best that we got then for the carpet it has some little dots on it do we have a dotted carpet i do feel like we have a dotted carpet a dotted carpet i do feel like we have one but i cannot find it so instead we're gonna use this carpet it has some sheep on them they're not dots but if we just squint our eyes and go all the way out they kind of look like little dots oh that's fine by me. All right, so for the back, what is going on in the back? They have this little picture wall, collage wall, table shenanigan shelf thingy. All right, this is why I'm gonna put up my pictures. My picture wall. Okay, so for the table thingy in the back, I think I'm gonna use this one. I have searched through everything, and this one is the closest match. Okay, so what's on top of there? I think we can have that light, and then one of these, maybe, and some little potted plants, and one more plant, maybe, just for the ambiance. I can put that one right there. Yeah, and then just a little book. Yeah. And what can we have here? Maybe I can put up a little bar. How about that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that can be there. But now, I thought that we shan't move on to the upstairs. And for the upstairs, I think it's good that we start with the hallway. So we don't just walk straight into a bedroom, you know? That's a good idea. Pinterest, give me my upstairs hallway. Oh, that looks lovely. Okay, so what do we have in this hallway? We have the stairs. That makes sense with it being an upstairs hallway. Well, they have their stairs straight on. And we have a little wiggly woogla. <laughs> so... <laughs> Interesting. So the hallway must be this way. Oh, wait, hold on. We also need some windows. But that means that this hallway is going to be so freaking long. Well, that's not going to work. Okay, so if I just go like so, and then I put in some railings, pretend that's a part of a staircase, and I'm going to remove the floor. Oh, that's not good. That's no bueno. Bring it back. <laughs> Maybe I should take this a little bit in. That's going to look so weird. But whatever. We're already here. <laughs> and then for the carpet, a little, little carpet. I mean, we do have that carpet, but that's really does it match the vibe does it pass the vibe check i think i just made everything worse i don't know how that's possible but i think i did okay maybe that one could work i said with a question mark i think i'm gonna try with that look how many carpets i went through i oh that is gonna be annoying well then it's gonna be the carpet that i first began with i love la 
guy. And then they have that funky, funky mirror. I don't think we have that funky mirror or anything like it, sadly. Do we have a wide picture frame that is all wiggly wiggly? What about this? No, it doesn't really work. What about this picture? I mean, yeah, happy with that. Moving on. And here, instead of a window, we can have a door. Genius idea. But a door with some windows in. Nora and her genius ideas, I tell you. Beautiful. Oh, and there's a little basket on the stairs. Oh, well, you can get this one. Put it on the stairs. There we go. You're very welcome. Right, so that was the hallway. Oh my gosh. Let's just move on to the bedroom. So, Pinterest, give me me primary bedroom. Oh, look at that. That's fancy. I can do that. And by the way, I'm so sorry that I'm not decorating as much as I usually do, especially in this room. But I have so many rooms to do here. So many rooms. And it's now currently 5 p.m. And my bedtime is at 11. So, <laughs> you know? Yeah, thank you for understanding. Was that a skateboard or a fighter jet? Maybe a fighter jet. Okay, we can have the primary bedroom in here or here. I don't know. Well, let's just try. I'm gonna find a nice comfy bed for them. They have a big old headboard. But jiba juba da. No, I think I... Hmm. Every time... Oh my gosh. Every time I speak, that fighter jet is coming back. Gang. Gang alang. So this bed. I mean, this bed is ugly, isn't it? But it has a plush headboard. And I don't think I can make my own headboard. I could if it was wood. But I don't think uh, there's a plush fence in the bed. Because I know. If there was, I would be very surprised. Yeah, so should I go with this bed or that bed? Because this one's nicer, but this one matches more. What is going to make you happy today? Which bed? I mean, it's really a damned if I do, damned if I don't moment. Indeed. Right, I'm going to go with this bed. Made my choice. Don't want to hear about it. Don't want to hear about it. Yeah, if you ever hear a fighter jet in the back of my bed, videos. The reason is because there is a fighter jet in the back of my videos. <laughs> Was that my point with that? I don't know. Because I, I live next to a military base. So yeah, I, that, that I do. But yeah, that's why. That's why you can hear the fighter jets. And I think they're trying to sell one of their fighter jets. So they're test driving it just as you would with a car. And they still haven't sold it because they fly that freaking fighter jet every single day for weeks. I hope they sell it soon. I mean, shoot, maybe I have to buy it just to make it stop, you know. So, you know, please subscribe to this channel so Nora can buy that fighter jet. <laughs> I need to scrounge up some money. Just a million or two. I don't know. Let's get in them curtains. You can get those curtains. They don't really match, but that's the best I can do. And I do believe I can throw some extra pillows on there. Just for the ambience. Ambience. That's a big pillow. Something around there. Wait, what? Hold on. If I try to paint my wall, it's going to delete my pillow. What? That's absurd. Okay, well, goodbye, pillow. You will be missed. So that was the bedroom. So let's move on to a um, big kid's bedroom, maybe. What? Okay, all the other bedrooms look like kids' bedrooms. But the first picture that comes up. I mean, is that a kid's bedroom? It doesn't scream a kid to me, you know? There's an old woman living here. Or Nora. Nora could also live there. And why so many flowers? Is it AI? It's probably AI. But, um, alright. Where can I have the kid's bedroom? Well, I don't think I can put the kid's bedroom here because of the door. I mean, that poor kid. <laughs> so maybe, but just maybe, it can be here. So first of all, let's just put up a window. And then we need a curtain. It doesn't fit the window size. Oh my gosh, I so need that modern luxe kit for the freaking... Yeah, You know what? I'm gonna do it. I have lived through so much suffering with these gosh darn curtains. I'm gonna buy that kit just for the curtain rod. I don't care anymore. I don't even care. Alrighty tidy. I have now bought the gosh darn kit just for the curtain rods. Just for the curtain rods. There. Thank you. Now for the bed. I mean, that one fits the vibe more, I feel. That'll do. Just fine. And then we need a little night table. Can't really see it, but it's there. It would be weird if I could see it and it was not there. That it, that it would. You're right. It, it would be weird. There you go. Your own little night table. What else do you have? You have a radiator. That's a good thing to have. And now I just need to put up a boatload of books. Yes, the kid has a boatload of books. And now we need some pictures. I mean, we don't really have that much space up there. <laughs> oh no. You know what? I can lower the shelves down a little bit. Oh no, I gotta lower this shelf down too. It's all be books. This is probably gonna ruin everything. I can feel it. Oh Jesus, where did they go? Now we have a little bit more space <laughs> for the pictures. Beautiful. And then some plants. Can't forget about the plants. Oh, she has a window as well. Oh, I mean, Pinterest loves their windowsills. That's what I've gathered here today. They do. I mean, this wouldn't really be safe <laughs> to have a shelf above the radiator, but um, not my problem. Not me problemus. And she also got a little urn. I didn't mean to go see this or there, but um, it just, it, it, it matches the color theme. It does. Oh, maybe I should put some wallpaper in that. That, that may be good. Some very pale light green, maybe? Oh no, my books disappeared. Every time I paint the walls, the books disappear. 
here and I don't know why, but there's something strange in the neighborhood. Look how cute this room looks. It's so cute. And then you just pan out and you see this empty hole. <laughs> oh, the carpet. The room has two carpets. One of them begins here and the other ends there. I don't know what to do with this information. Maybe it can be something like that. Let's move on to the next room. Don't look at the emptiness. I'm going to fix that. I promise. Let's move on to the next room. What can that be? I mean, we are really in desperate needs of another hallway. There we are. So Pinterest, give me my COVID up. All right. That is a very boring and modern hallway. It, it is. Okay, so they have some spotlights, just like so. And there's some light brown modern doors. There you go. I mean, we must have a door there. They have two doors, actually. All right. I can do something like that. And then we just have to change around stuff in there. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that looks horrible. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Then some little pictures on the wall. That was the hallway. Amazing, isn't it? It, it is. Let's move on to another room. <laughs> Pinterest, give me my teen bedroom. Oh, well, that's also very modern. I don't know what's going on in this house. All right, so this bed could work. I mean, I could make this myself, but that does indeed mean that this bed won't be functional if I make it myself. But then again, it's so much more fun to do it this way. Mm -hmm. And then for the nightstand, this one would have been like perfect if it totally changed everything about itself. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna go with that. And now we need a skinny desk. I mean, again, I could make one myself. That I could, but do I want to? I can try real quick to make a little desk. That can, that can work. Sure. <laughs> you can get that computer and you also need a poof. I mean, this one can work if I just go like so and I scale them down to nothing. <laughs> Look at those tiny little things. And I take me poof. Yeah, that's looking very cute. And there's also this funky, funky shelf. I see, I see. Yeah, the one on the bottom is an open shelf, but I don't want to move this because it's all connected now. And then just some plants everywhere. I mean, these people and their plants. Oh, and then there's a shelf here with some more plants and a windowsill as well. I'll show you how it is. Here is the bedroom. Oh my, oh me, oh my. Love, love, lovely bedroom. Alrighty, it's now time for the next room. And I had a little thing and I thought that we might do a little ensuite bathroom for the primary bedroom. So let's do that. Oh. Well, it's really just showing me one side of the bathroom. Oh, well, I can see a, I can see a glimpse of the shower. <laughs> Some blue counters. Oh, oh, yikes. I guess it has to be this. They have this little thing in the middle. Can I, can I do that as well? If I go like so. Um, interesting concept. Well, it has to work. Just ignore that little bump and everything will be all right. Just look like they have round things. That's what I can see with my eyes. So I don't like those things, but there you go. Be happy. Be happy with those things. And then some mirrors. I mean, oh. <laughs> no, I think it's got to be those mirrors. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. But it just has to be. Or I could. Oh, no. Here she goes again. What if I do a little mirror trick? No, hold on. That's not going to work. Because we don't have the right size mirror for that. Nope. It has to be these. I'm sorry. And then the lights. I think I'm going to go for this. Oh, that's ugly. <laughs> it is. And <laughs> it seems like they have a shower. It seems like it. So there's your shower. <laughs> and that's all I can see. For now. For now. Always. That's the bathroom. So, all right, all right. What was I talking about? I'm not really sure because I just had a little snack. As one might do at 8 p.m. The guest bedroom? Was that what we were doing? Can't each remember. But let's do guest bedroom. That seems like fun. This also looks like AI. I'm pretty sure that this is AI because it's looking weird. And that's sad. Tiffany C. Pinterest. I'm on to ya. I'm on to ya. Well, all righty. Where can we have the guest bedroom? We can have the guest bedroom here. That works fine by me. Oh, no, we can't because of the door. But you know what? This can be the guest bedroom because that's how you get your guests to leave. Make them really uncomfortable. Because you know, after three days, they gotta skedaddle. And some people, they don't get the memo. So you know, this, that will get them out of the house. The flooring, what's happening with the flooring? I don't really know. I, I, I don't know what I'm looking at right now. Kinda does look like concrete flooring. But that would be ridiculous. I'm just gonna go with that flooring. I have, I have chosen. And then for the bed, what can I do for the bed? All right, I've tried every single bed now. <laughs> no, I gotta stroke me on head. I do believe that this is our best bet. I mean, it doesn't look like it's a bed on the picture at all, in fact. But it does have a similar wood color. Jano? So I think I'm going to go for that. Yeah. Yeah. And then for the carpet. I mean, can I find a carpet? What happened to just having a white carpet for once? What happened to that? But okay, what about this carpet? It kind of, kind of matches with the bed. It doesn't look horrible. Let's get the nightstand in. It, it can just be like that then. 
Sure. Happy with that. Happy, happy with that. Oh, but jeepers me. My microphone wasn't recording. So, um, hope you enjoyed that very bad audio. I'm so sorry. What else do we have in this room? I can see some curtains. There you go. I'll be very happy with that. Oh, my carpet. My carpet. Very lovely. Let's move on to the next room, shall we? Or we shall. So, what are we gonna do now? I think we need another bathroom. That I do think we need. Ooh. All right. Okay, I can do that. That looks very lovely. Very lovely jubbly indeed. So, maybe the bathroom can be in here. Maybe we can squeeze one in. Just a like so what and then there's some white hexagon tiles so i don't have that that i do not maybe i can just do that <laughs> don't look at it too closely and it will be fine and then for the other flooring oh that's gonna be difficult do we have a black and white one hmm i mean that is carpet though that that is carpet i don't know what i feel about that all right i'm just gonna go for that one i need to move past this i'm just gonna have that that's the closest there's me toilet and then we shall get to this one and then the shower there we go then i need a one tile to do to the window can i find that that in this economy we shan't find out it's looking pretty slim well it just gotta be that then <laughs> now they do have a little line in the shower so i gotta improvise i can just do that the sims can step over that or not that's not my problem not anymore and then over the toilet they have some little shelves they have some shelves and in the shower they have a window but <laughs> i forgot about that i mean they're not gonna have a window <laughs> oops but they have this little table and on that little table they have some shampoo stuff and also a little plant yet again <laughs> i mean instead of the plant on the windowsill i'm just gonna what am i gonna do something at least they can get that one. Oop, there we go and maybe maybe a mirror i'm gonna be nice to them today and give them a mirror not even gonna think about it just this mirror there you go that was the bathroom it is so freaking late now all right it has come to this part in the video where i shall do a little speed build i forgot the word it's so late i'm gonna do a little speed build of the decoration so <laughs> so <laughs> i hope you enjoyed that now as i do this little speed decoration i'm gonna be so real with you guys i'm gonna be so freaking for real i am <laughs> you know what time it is right now it's 10 30 p.m 22 30 and i would like to go to bed soon because it's lights up by 11 at nora's place it is and you know i have a lot left to do there's so many rooms that's um not filled up and all the rooms that i have done are like half finished at most you know well i am speed decorating right now i hope maybe i'm not because it's really late so i'm not really sure what to do right now i am not i am really not how long have i been filming today by the way 11 hours that i've been doing this oh my gosh i've been doing this for 11 hours that's that's not good nora that's a new low for you okay excuse me what have i been doing for 11 hours because i mean to be fair i used most of my time on the exterior of the house i mean mostly went to this pond it did i am not sure what to do right now i am i'm really not okay so the day i'm filming this it's a thursday and this video is going up on sunday and i need like at least two days to edit because there's a lot of footage to edit okay i mean i've been filming for 11 hours that's a lot of footage to go through <laughs> oh no, what am I gonna do? I mean, why did I get such a big house? <laughs> that was my first mistake. It really was. What do you guys think that I should do <laughs> in this situation? I mean, option A is that this is the first part of a two-parter video and I finish the house next week. Or option C, I just leave it as it is and mark it as a fail. What do you think? <laughs> what do you think? Yeah, I'm I think I'm just gonna leave it here. And you, you are out there. You can decide what I shall do with this house. Sounds good. And if you're disappointed, just know that I am too. I am too. And if you're ever wondering why Nora does small houses, this is why. This is why I don't do big houses because it, it takes a long time. <laughs> so, um, let's do a house tour of what I've done. Maybe? Am I showing it or am I not? <laughs> Who knows? And I thought for this little segment, I'm just gonna sit here in silence. In disappointed silence. I mean, I like the rooms that I did, though. <laughs> that was a long silence, Nora. But I did. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> did I? <laughs> I mean, I think I did. Who, who knows anymore? It's been it's been a long day. I, I can't remember anything that I've done today, baby. Maybe. Probably. Uh, no. I have? Where am I? <laughs> Where am I in the sentence? Not sure. Um, can I distract you with something? I have a Moomin mug with the L on it. Because I stole my mom's. That's, her, that's the first letter in her name. I think I'm just going to go back to the silence now. Have, have I finished filming the house? I don't even know. Yeah, I think that's enough. <laughs> I think that's enough of that. All right, that was it for this time. Hope you really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it. Anyways, don't forget to like and subscribe because it really does help me out. So um, thank you. But only if you want to. Only if you want to. And I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.